Lake Victoria is Africa's largest lake and the source for the world's longest river, the Nile. Home to an estimated 350 different species of fish, Lake Victoria is a vital resource to those living in surrounding areas. However, growing populations have overwhelmed the ecosystem, making it harder for the ecosystem to support the local communities that rely on it so heavily. <laughs> Era to Funemi and the Minjin gave Yanja Vifa. Nature's which are your nanti sing, gave Yanja Vibu Buse, Natavifu Tabiravica. Cutting gave his heavy gave him a giving Yanja Vari Gurid, Nga, at a Sanu who go home at Dogenze Kuvu, Nengo Genda Vayonga to Nia de Chinyanji Chimu. Eighty five per cent of the people in this island, their mainly source of livelihood or economic activity is the lake. The lake the land and the trees, everything had been depleted. The bigger the family size, the more fish or resources will be required to feed the family. To reduce threats to biodiversity conservation and ecosystem degradation in the Lake Victoria Basin and simultaneously increase access to family planning and maternal, newborn and child health services in local communities, Pathfinder International and local partners created the Health of People and the Environment Lake Victoria Basin Project or HOPE LVB. Several activities under HOPE LVB align with certain elements of the family planning high impact practices or HIPS. HIPS are evidence-based family planning practices that reflect expert consensus around what works in family planning. The HIPS elements that HOPE LVB implemented include training and supporting community health workers, working with community groups and leaders to conduct interpersonal communication and community group engagement activities, and encouraging leaders at all levels of government to broaden the reach of family planning services in the project areas through advocacy and accountability efforts. <laughs> In addition to counseling with community health workers, women in the area have found the community group engagement activities very helpful. From the start of the project, Hope LVB and partners worked on policy advocacy at the local level, which resulted in upgraded health facilities and the creation of local bylaws. Over the first three years of the project, Hope LVB had impressive results. From 2012 to 2016, voluntary family planning use increased by six times in Kenya and three times in Uganda. To build on such strong results, Hope LVB could benefit from using more HIPS as the project strives for strong family planning outcomes as part of its overall objectives. To learn more about HIPS, visit www.fbhighimpactpractices.org.